How's it going everybody? It's Gorilla Man here. In today's video, we are going to be doing something special, something that I've been kind of working towards the entire time we've been playing recently, and that is going to be barn finds and case openings. So, if you guys know every single time, I think it's I think it's every time you complete a main quest or storyline or even just a quest, there's a chance uh for you to be rewarded with a case which looks like this and it contains three parts and you have the potential i don't even know if it's like a 30 percent chance or something like that to get a barn find it's a pretty pretty good percentage though um so like this right here this is a story mission so if i would complete this i would get a case with it um so what we're gonna do today is we're gonna open those cases that i've got from the past couple videos and then we are also going to be doing all the barn finds we get and we're gonna be collecting a bunch of cars and seeing how we can do because I really like doing barn finds because it's just super, super special, and it's like a, it's like a one in a hundred chance to see what you can get. So let's see here. All right. So first off, let's open this first case. So we're hoping for barn finds. So there's no barn find now. That sucks, but it's all right. We still get some really nice parts usually. A plus two quality rubber bushing. Nice. What do we got here? No barn find. Looks like radiator, air filter, and a front suspension. All right. Anything else in here? All right. Doesn't look like it. So I'm going to go through now. So we'll add all of our barn finds to our maps. Looks like we only got two, actually. I was expecting us to have more. I know we have one already activated. So let me just scroll back through here really quick. All right. I think... I think we're good. I think we already have a few on the map, so so let's go over and check that out. So we got one, two, oh yeah, we got three barn finds. All right, that's awesome. So my main goal for these barn finds is going to be some really unique cars or trucks, because we do have quite a few trucks added um, to our my modding inventory. So I'm gonna scooch this one over to entrance B. This guy is done. How much was this one worth? two hundred thousand dollars okay uh we're gonna save this one to parking and this one can stay so we got three slots open uh for new cars to be brought into us okay so now that we got the room let's go to our very first barn find uh let's go to this one we'll start from the bottom we'll work our way up the side of the map here so what i'm hoping for is a three car barn um, obviously because you get three cars in it and something with a lot of extra stuff more crates You know more cases everything all the goods. Let's just see what we can get here. Oh Whoa, there we go. Uh, all right, we got a two um, What is this? Okay, this is an in-game car a bolt Chapman F mill then we got a Jeep Willys here military edition and it is painted yellow interesting, okay So really quick all oh, right there that's what I was looking for. So usually these barns will have maybe one case in them, maybe. Um, and looks like we found it. I'm going to go through the rest just to make sure. All right, that looks good. Well, we found a old Jeep Willys. We could totally go in and redo this guy. But I'm not sure yet. All right, we'll buy it. You know, I'm going to buy this one. Go to parking just because the barn finds are usually in much much better shape than anything you'd find in the junkyard uh the auction yard could be a little bit better but it's you're gonna pay like three times the price but obviously it will be in better condition all right now that we're back let's open this case barn find maybe oh there we go we got a barn find that's awesome and we got like an intercooler or a bottom suspension. Oh, timing chain. Sweet. Uh-oh. What was that? There we go. So we got this barn destination. We'll add that one to our map. All right, let's go to that one. So we just so we we went to a barn find and we found another barn find. It's super 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 nice when that happens. Alright, oh, we're in a very crowded old garage here. 
So first off, we're going to start by... Oh, yes! Another case. Awesome, awesome, awesome. So we're going to start out by checking all the junk here. Checking for anything that could be of value. Looks like we're not going to get anything. Alright, that's alright. But we did have... Oh, this is two car, actually. This is a Bolt Reptilia D&R, which... It's like an old Corvette. Obviously, it's like an old Stingray. Then looks like we found ourselves a Bronco. No, this is... Yeah, this is a Bronco. It's a Mark III from 83. Interesting. Hmm. Don't know how I feel about these. This Bull Reptilia could be really cool, actually. You know, we'll pick this one up. 30000 that one will go into there. We could do an old, nice uh, muscle car build off of that. All right, and that's it. I'm not going to buy the uh, the Bronco because I've done like four or five Broncos in the past now. So I'm going to try and stray away from those. Don't have to do them. So we're going to get back. We're going to open up this next case, maybe get another barn find, and then finish our last two. All right, a barn find would be awesome. Oh my gosh, that is crazy. Wow, I am getting... I don't even know how you compare this luck. Like, this is like some next level luck right here. Where was it at? Oh, it goes way up there. Okay, we'll do the bottom right one then. That's crazy. Two barn finds from barn finds. If it keeps up at this rate, I might just like continue doing barn finds for the rest of my life now. I mean, nothing else. Might just have to have this video going on for a couple hours. All right, let's check these junk piles. So immediately off the bat, we got like a Mustang collector. This is a GT five hundred sixty seven coupe, and this is a sixty. This is a race car edition. Oh, whoa, okay. This is a special one right here. I have not found this one before. Yeah, I have never seen this one before. That is really really cool. I'm gonna peek around these. And what is this? A Luxor Bowen. It's a big one. Oh, trying to squeeze through here. Trying to check all these piles for some crates and cases. Oh, there we go. Sweet. Alright, so we are definitely going to be picking up some stuff here. I was going to say, is there, another, is there another car back here? Yeah, so this right here, guys. This is the ideal garage that we are looking for. A three-car garage. I think I already looked in that one. With tons of junk laying around. Tons of stuff for us to check out. Whoa, this thing looks so cool. So this is a GT500 race car. It's like a 67, 68. That one's going to be sent to the garage. And since we picked up that one, I'm not going to pick up this one right here. And we'll leave with the crate. So we'll take... So crates are only 200 bucks, by the way. So... It's like basically paying about two dollars for almost for finding a barn find. It's pretty cool. All right, so then let's open another case. Oh, and those streak breaks. Okay, that's okay. We still got two more to do though. Okay, we can use that crankshaft pulley at one of these parts. All right, we're swinging up to the top right of the map. Looks like we get some farm fields. We're getting some more barn finds to do. Oh, come on. Give me something good. Give me something special. Oh, we got a small one here. Oh, okay. That's pretty cool. We found a Lotus S-Spirit S1. That is pretty crazy, actually. That's like a... Like, in real life, if you were to find something like that, that would be absolutely insane. The fact that some, like, person put away a, a Lotus away in the garage, that's pretty cool. Alright, sorting through all these junks. There's the case. Score. And we're going to pick up this S-Spirit, and we're going to add it to our garage. Nice. Alright. Leave the parts. That was a uh, pretty good find there. Very, very nice. I think the GT500 race car was probably better, but... You know, still, it's pretty cool. Pretty cool find. Alright, looks like we're filling up our garage pretty quickly here. Let's 
open this case up. And another barn find. Look at that. Wow, this is this is pretty crazy. This is <laughs> is that another another two left? Nice. Oh my gosh. I don't think I've ever done this many barn finds in one video before. I just I, I don't think so. There's just so many. I'm just getting so lucky finding more and more crates with more and more finds in them. There's our first case. Whoa, we got some weird ones here. What do we got? Bolt Chapman and the Ghostbusters car. All right, we're going to skip that one. We're going to go back and skip that one. All right, so let's get this case open. Another barn find? No. Oh, that's it's two streaks broken right in a row. We are getting some pretty good quality items here. I'm not, I'm honestly, guys, I'm not 100% sure what the quality aspects of these items does. But I, I'll, I'll, find, I'll find out soon. I should probably go through and find out. Try and give like the most maximum quality uh, car out there or something like that. Okay, this is a uh, this is very interesting. I uh, went to a barn and uh, I found a uh, I found a tractor. This is a V12 twin turbo. Uh, looks like a a Pagani Pagani turbo tractor. Can I even get in here? There we go. Yeah, that is uh, that is very interesting. Okay, let me sort through all the junk here. You know what? We're buying it. We found a tractor in here. You know what? We're buying it. Why not? And there's our case. Awesome. Pretty easy. So this is me, our last try at these cases to see if we get anything. If we don't, we don't. I mean, if we do, we do. That's what was that? Seven or eight barn finds in one video? That's yeah. So seven or eight. That's pretty crazy, actually, for me. All right. Let's see what we can get. Hey, there's another one. All right, sweet. We're not leaving off yet. That's the second time I've gotten this belt here, isn't it? I thought it was. That's, that's a lot, though. All right, there we go. A lot of green quality. All right, maybe, possibly, last barn find here, guys. I'm not sure. Very, 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 very possible. Let's find out, though. Oh, we got a pretty cool find here. Let me check this junk. Scooch through here. Nothing there. Uh, nothing there. But hey, look at this. We got a mark. Oh, it's only an. Oh, you know, this isn't. An... Okay, yeah. Yeah, we got a super here. So that's pretty cool. Oh, we got another Lamborghini. Nitro, so this is like a more of a normal looking one. And we got nothing here. I am gonna buy that Supra, 100%. Let me see here. Oh, there's the case score. And then also, ooh, a 2017 Ram Power Wagon. I could convert this into a new work truck. Okay, looks like we're spending a lot of money in today. Car value of $162,000 up here, guys. So it does you do lose an immediate 30 grand. So you can't just buy these and then sell them. You got to put some work into them. All right. There's the Supra. I'm going to pick this guy up too. Wow, I'm going to have a uh, I'm going to have a lot of stuff to work on. I do really want to do that uh that Ram Power Wagon pretty soon though. All right, we're gonna open up this case again to see what else we can get. Ah, uh, and the shriek is broken. Drive shaft, fuel injector, and a rim. All right, that was pretty good though. That was about eight. Was it eight or nine? Eight or nine there, guys. That was a that was a lot of barn finds, but we found a ton 
of super cool cars, some trucks, you know, a tractor there. That was pretty neat. Um, but yeah, there's a lot here to work on. Like this Lotus S Spirit, pretty close to mint condition on like the body and frame. So that's pretty impressive if you ask me. So we'll have to be working on these things first. Um, that Ram, I'll turn that into my work truck. We got a ton of stuff to do. But if you guys enjoyed this video, leave a like and a comment down below. And maybe I'll try and do a couple more uh, auction and uh, barn find videos just because they're pretty fun. And you, you literally don't know what you're ever going to get. So I really enjoy them. I hope you guys enjoyed them. And I will see you all in the next Car Mechanic Simulator video.